I always had a knack for art, especially calligraphy. My evolution from graffiti moved pretty organically to tattoos. I always wanted to be different because I wanted the route of creativity and freedom, nothing less. Although I live and work in Rome, Italy, home for me is my crew. It's much more than just hanging out together. It's beyond friendship. It's where I find security. When it comes to graffiti, I prefer to spray alone or maybe with one other person. I don't mind switching it up sometimes. I paint it with big groups of more than 30 people, but generally I don't like having company, especially during nighttime work. It's more discreet when I'm on my own. I live by the principles of love, respect, and realness. I can't comprehend how some people flush their lives down the toilet. It disgusts me how a person can ruin their own life despite being given so many opportunities. Of course I'm flawed in some ways too, isn't everyone? Sometimes I drink and smoke too much but you have to have some vice to keep life interesting. If I hadn't started tattooing, I probably would still be looking for the right job. Perhaps playing basketball professionally. I was good with numbers at school so maybe something in that direction. When I get old, I think I might also turn to writing illustrated books. I love to tattoo lettering. I could do letters and drawings every day, doesn't mind if it's on skin or walls. If a customer walks in and asks me to freehand the entire tattoo, I'd for sure do a classic black and gray drawing with a nice lettering composition. There are downsides to being a tattoo artist. Large jobs can be tiring because they require a lot of concentration over a long period of time. It takes more patience to create an art piece on a living canvas instead of a rigid wall. If my life would be a movie, it probably would be a documentary or maybe even an adventure. I would call it blunted life. I go by the name of Blunt, after all. 